Hello guys, welcome back to another Spelunky video, and this Spelunky video is a lot different from my other Spelunky videos, because today I'll be making a tier list of my favorites, or ranking all the Spelunky 2 character designs, well most of the characters, like all the playable characters, and some NPCs, some NPCs. Uh, sadly, I don't have Shopkeeper on this list, because I couldn't find like a good picture of him, but I do have Van Horsing, and I do have <laughs> the Slime Guy. And I do have Terra Tunnel. So let's make this list. First on the list, or first to be picked, we have Alto. Alto, I really like his design. In Splunky 1, he was known as Red. In Splunky 2, they actually gave him a name, but most importantly, the design, I love it. You know, it's okay for what it is. I'll, I'll put that pretty good. Or okay. It's simplistic, but it's okay. It's okay. Now, the new, I forgot her name, Anna Spelunky. Anna Spelunky, yes. Anna Spelunky, she is the successor to Guy Spelunky. Really good de design. When I first saw it back in 2017, I was like, that's that's pretty good. Pretty good design. Uh, yeah, I'll put it in pretty good. Now the new Gold Man, or Golden Buddha. Golden Buddha, a masterpiece. Just Let's just put it up there in masterpiece. <laughs> he was my favorite skin in Spelunky 1, and I love the new design in Spelunky 2. I'm just going to put it in masterpiece right away. Sky Spelunky. Now, this is a, this is probably the most interesting skin or character design in Spelunky 2. Because of its, like, unique texture and design. <laughs> it's pixelated, which is a reference to, like, the original Spelunky that was made in 2008 by Derek Yu. So, I'm gonna put this in Masterpiece, because it looks really good. It looks amazing. Uh, Coco Von Diamonds. Coco Von Diamonds. Um, pretty, pretty okay skin. I mean, it's not anything, like, special. So I'll put it in, okay. Colin Northwad, a reference to Colin Northway. In Spelunky 1, he was just known as, like, Blue or something. He, he's an okay skin. I mean, nothing special again, so I'll just put him in okay. Uh, now, the skin, it's like something Von Diamonds. Uh, but she's related to Coco Von Diamonds. And actually, in Spelunky 1, she was, like, the default damsel, female damsel skin. Which was which is pretty cool. They made her like an actual character. I did not expect that from Splunky. That's really cool. Really cool, Derek. You. Um, uh, her design is more stylized in Splunky Two than Splunky One. And personally, I do like the skin. <laughs> it's really good. So I'm gonna put it in pretty good. So yeah, this this is kind of biased, I guess. Dirk Yamoka, he is a ninja skin, but I have not unlocked him yet in Spunky 2. Uh, he is in Spunky 1, he was like the ninja character, but in Spunky 1, he was green, not he had green armor, and he was like robes and not black uh, metal armor. So that's kind of weird, but I like the new design. I like the new armor. It looks more mysterious. Yes, more mysterious. Now I'm gonna put this in pretty pretty good because i like it. i like it personally a lot i like his design guy spelunky now this guy i like his skin a lot i like his skin a lot compared to like guy spelunky or he was just named like spelunker and spelunky one you know he's a lot better he's a lot better i love the new beard i love it i'm gonna put it in pretty good not quite masterpiece material but pretty pretty good uh <laughs> Now the robot, or the new robot. In Splunky 1, I actually, I like the robot better in Splunky 1, because I felt like it looked more cartoonish, in a way. And you might say, well, this looks cartoonish, but the robot in Splunky 1 kind of just looked like, you know, the average robot you'd see anybody sketch up. This kind of just looks like a high advanced robot. I still like the design for this, uh, but I kind of like Splunky 1's robot better. I'll put this in, okay. It's okay. Okay, now on to... This guy, and Splunky won, like, he and, like, her over here were, like, both named, like, his name was Fat Boy, and her name was, like, or her name was Fat Girl, and I thought that was pretty weird how they're named that based on their appearances in Splunky 1, but they actually gave them names. This guy's name is Jay, and this guy, her name is, I forgot it, <laughs> but Jay... I like his design. It's it's okay. It's pretty simplistic again. Not anything like extraordinary or special or cool. It's just a, it's a simple design. So I'll put it in okay. Now the green girl or Liz is her name, I think. 
Uh, Liz is, you know, okay. Spunky one, she's known as Green. You guys probably know that. Uh, she's okay. She's okay. I mean, I wish they could actually, like, you know, improve more of the design, but the design is good. So far, we have a lot in okay, some in pretty good, and very little in masterpiece. None in could be better, none in bad. Like, honestly, I don't think any of these skins are bad. Like, some of them I could see they could do better. And, you know, but that's okay. Now, this guy, Tunnel Man. If you, his transformation is legendary. If you look at Spunky 1's Tunnel Man, he has an afro, he has an eye patch, you know. But Spunky 2's Tunnel Man, he looks like he aged 30 years. I mean, he's a legend. I have to put him in Masterpiece. I have to. I have to. Now, let's go on to his daughter, I believe. Margaret Tunnel. Margaret, pretty good design, but it's kind of just like, it's kind of like Anna, you know, it's kind of like Alto, pretty simplistic, not much, not much, except like some, a uh, few features, you know, i will put it in okay. Uh, let's go on to NECA, NECA, you unlock in jungle and stuff, in the black market, I think. New skin, new design, I like it personally, I like it, not my favorite skin, but I like it. I like it. I'll put it in. Okay. You know, it's not special. Now, <laughs> this guy, ooh. I like his skin. It's it's new. And I think I just learned today that's actually a reference to Derek Yu's new upcoming game. It's, I think it's called UFO 51 or something like that. And that and his name is like Pilot and he's a reference to the game that's coming out by Moss Mouth. So that's pretty cool. I also like his design. I when I first saw it in the trailer or like the <laughs> The video Derek you made. I was like, he looks kind of cool. I'm not sure why he's like so different from the other Splunkers. I just learned today. He's a reference to another game that's coming out. So that's pretty cool. I'll put him in pretty good because I, I, I kind of like it. Okay. Now, uh, Princess. Forgot her name. <laughs> I'm sorry. I forgot her name. Uh, she has a pretty good design. Like, it's, it's like a lot more. Than the other Splunkers. Like, usually the other Splunkers, they have, you know, just a common suit. But she has, like, a dress. And that's kind of unique for a Splunky character. Not many have them. I think that she's, like, the only one that has, like, a dress, maybe? So, I'll put her in, like... I like your design, so I'll put it in pretty good. Um... Who next? Oh, Rafi Diesel. You know where we're putting Rafi. Bad, I'm just kidding, I'm not going to put him in bad, we're going to put him in Masterpiece, and all of you know why, Rafi is going in Masterpiece, he's just, he's just a Masterpiece, okay, the design of a sloth, like, oh my god, also fun fact, Rafi the sloth is a reference to, I think, it was like another, um, he was a reference to another game or something like that, I, I read it in like, uh, the Spelunky 2, like, fandom, or not fandom, like Wikipedia or something. It's pretty interesting, but he's also a reference to something else, which is pretty cool. Now, Terra Tunnel. Terra Tunnel's design is pretty cool. She's an NPC, uh, which is cool. She's, she has a good design for an NPC. She shows up, she's basically like the Tunnel Man, or the, I guess now Tunnel Woman of Splunky 2. So, I'm gonna put her design in. Okay, we're pretty good. Uh, I'll put it in. I'll put it in pretty good. Or, pretty good, yeah, pretty good. Now, uh, <laughs> I forgot her name in Sp Oh, Tina, Tina Flan, Tina Flan, yeah. I just remembered it. I was gonna say yellow, because her name in Spelunky 2 was like, I mean, Spelunky 1 was yellow. And her name in Spelunky 2 is Tina Flan. But I haven't unlocked her yet, because I haven't got well, gone, like, to where you have to unlock her. But anyway, uh, her design is just like her design from Spelunky 1. Nothing much has changed. It's kind of like, um... Green, Green's design, or Liz's design, nothing much has changed from Splunky 1, it's not like Alto where some has changed, but I'm gonna put Tina in okay, in okay, uh, now, I forgot her name, is her name like Valerie or something, Valerie, Valerie Crump, Crump, yeah, I think, I think that's her name, um, she was in Splunky 1, as I said, she, her name was like Fat Girl, which is kind of like, ooh, Splunky 1, throwing some shade <laughs> at that character. But, I liked her design. Her design, her new design is quite different, I will say, from like, 
her old design. Because, <laughs> yeah, they made, they put headphones on and stuff like that, but I'll put it in okay. I'll put it in okay. Now, we're on to our last two characters, and they're both NPCs. I think this guy, this guy is the slime, the slime's name, sorry. The slime's name is the Guzzler or the Wuzzler or something like that. Uh, he's like a secret NPC that you have to do some secret stuff to find. I've, I've met him like before in Splunky 2. Um, I, I like his design. I'm going to put it in pretty good because it's an interesting design that's a lot different and more unique. And now to uh, hunt a Van Horsing. Van Horsing, in Splunky 2, I mean, in Splunky 1, he was actually a playable character, Van Helsing, and you would unlock him by getting to, like, Dracula's castle and stuff like that, Flat's castle. But, in Splunky 2, uh, <laughs> he's, like, just a regular NPC. That, he, he can give you a lot of good stuff that you actually need to progress in the game. Like, he gives you the device that you can get to, um, Mothership with in Splunky 2. But, you know, his, his, his new design, they made him older. I'm gonna put it in, in pretty good. In pretty good. Um, well, that's it for my Splunky 2 tier list. Uh, this, this is my first tier list. Well, yeah, and by the way, this is just ty entirely on my opinion. Like, like I, you know, this is just entirely subjective on my opinion. But other than that, this is the end of this video, and I'll see you next time in another video, guys. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.